It's a book by Adam Michnik, uh, famous Polish historian, uh, political thinker, dissident. He's currently the editor-in-chief of Poland's most circulated daily newspaper, Gazeta Wyborcza, and um, also very well known uh, in the United States. The book is called Letters from Prison and other essays, and uh, as the title says, these are some of the most important essays and articles and letters uh, written by Adam Michnik during his uh, several periods, periods in jail. That's an argument of how to oppose a violent regime. It doesn't matter whether the communists uh, used violence every day. It so happened that whenever challenged, they used violence. It's also called letters because it includes a wonderful and deeply moving and extremely funny letter uh, written under tragic circumstances at a certain moment when Michnik was arrested, he was, as I said, one of the leaders of Solidarity. Solidarity was legally established as an autonomous, self-governing uh, trade union in August 1980, and it was banned via the proclamation of the martial law by the communist uh, dictatorship, headed by General Wojciech Jaruzelski in December, on December 13, 1980. 81. Michnik, together with so many of his uh, close friends uh, and, and uh, associates, were arrested and he spent uh, three or four years in prison as a result of this. Uh, and at a certain moment he was offered a deal by the Minister of Internal Affairs, General Czesław Kiszczak. The Department of the Interior is not the Department of Natural Parks in, in a communist regime, it's the Department dealing with the secret police. So the head of the secret police uh, offered Michnik a uh, free ticket to leave the prison, to leave Poland, and to go to France, uh, to the Riviera. And uh, Michnik's response, which is a letter he penned in prison, was smuggled out of the cell and came out in many Western newspapers and the Polish underground solidarity press, in which he explained to General Kiszczak why he doesn't accept this offer. And the last lines, which as I said, it's, it's funny and it's enormously courageous because he was a prisoner of this particular person. Uh, the last line is something like that, and you'll never understand, General, why I don't accept your offer. And you know why you'll not understand it. Very simple, because I'm a human being and you're a pig. And that was the last line.